did somebody say roguelike deck builder auto battler? Because uh, that's what we've got on our hands today. This is Face Hand, another demo that's come out as part of the Steam Next Fest. And uh, basically, it's picking the boxes already. Roguelike deck builder auto battler. So I think Super Auto Pets, I guess, it would be an inspiration. But again, going in blind. So let's jump in and check it out. Get 10 coins at the start of a shop session. You buy cards and items for two coins each. Reroll the shop for one coin. Cards on sale cost one coin. Any unspent coins are lost, so use them all. Interesting. What have we got? View your deck. Empty. Upcoming. Enraged. They've got what I assume to be one attack and 20 health. We can buy a mind blown emoji. When it's hurt, it shoots the enemy for four damage. When it's activated, it gives plus two attack to the ally behind. And we can get heart eyes, which when activated, gives plus two health to an ally behind. So this thing has low attack, but 20 health. How am I supposed to defeat that with one, two, and one damage? I suppose that's the challenge. Candy gives a card to attack and a bomb gives a card the bomb rune, which when destroyed, shoots the enemy for 100% attack. Interesting. Um, so I've got 10 coins. This one on sale will cost me one. This will cost me two. That'll give me attack. And this will do a good bit of damage as well. So I want to get that. I'm also going to roll. And get two more. Sprout. Give the card a sprout rune. When destroyed, summons a daisy with 100% attack and one health. Okay. Dog. Ally summon. Give it plus two attack. Kissing. Give one one to a random ally. And we've already got a hard eyes. I'm going to get a dog. I'm going to get a kissing face. Let's just see what happens. So I've got no idea how this combat's going to go. <laughs> but we'll see. This is the battle phase. It appears after every shop phase. If your deck has less than 14 cards, the remaining slots are filled with temporary poop. <laughs> Good to know. Nope, oh, there it is. Each turn, draw a hand of seven cards. You choose up to five cards, put on the field, and press play. In the top left is the number of hands you have left. Gotcha. Defeat the enemy within this number of turns, or you lose. So I have three hands to defeat this enraged emoji with 20 health. Well, I'm going to put joy first. It'll do two damage. It'll then give two attack to this temporary poop. I guess I'm just going to fill the ranks with poop. I'm going to poop everywhere. But they're going to do their little thing. There we go. This is making sense now. Eight damage done. And I summoned give it plus two attack. Does that count? Am I summoning them by playing them or is summoning like a special ability? Let's find out. Yep, must be a special ability. So this will do four damage. When this is activated, it gives 1-1 one, one to someone. So I guess we'll just do this. Okay, you've done your 4 damage. Beautiful, we've done it. Ah, oh, and overkill. There you go. Add an extra hand, so we get an extra coin for my trouble. Click the deck icon in the bottom left to view your deck. Drag duplicate cards on top of each other to level them up. Right click cards to permanently remove them. Interesting. So duplicate cards you level up by dragging onto each other. But if I right click, I, I can remove them freely. Which is a big thing for a deck builder usually. When destroyed, shoot the enemy for 100% attack. That's good. I'll get the dog. I'll get the kissing face. Why not? Hamster. Kissing face. Hard eyes. Can't afford that, but what I can do is I'm gonna level up the kissing face. And when that's activated, a random ally gets 3 3. I won't combine these just yet. Now, the enemy we're facing this time has 30 health. Oh, I could have re rolled and frozen something in the shop. Anyway, uh, let's see. Yep, 
You can give health to this guy so he gets a few more attacks off with two damage. Then when he's activated, he will give this guy extra damage and then he'll shoot off four more damage. And then I'll just fill the blanks with poop. There we go. All right, we're more than halfway there. Let's see. When that's activated, give 3-3 three, three to a random ally. I'm going to put you there. So that the only ally remaining is this one. And then when he's destroyed, he will shoot the enemy for his attack, which is 2, plus this 3. You should be laughing. Uh, I'm going to also put you there. Because then you'll have lots of health. And get plenty of attacks off. So let's try this. So that'll be way overkill. <laughs> Absolutely smashed him. Beautiful. Another dog. I don't mind upgrading. Buying that so I can upgrade the dog. Heart eyes. That's another upgrade. Let's grab it. Activated game plus two attack. Sure, why not? Vampire. Set health equal to 100% of the healthiest allies' health. Raccoon, ally destroyed, gain two attack. Oh, that's good. Ally head buffed, gain two attack. Interesting. I'd like to take all of these, but I think I'm gonna grab two. I'll grab you, you, and a candy card. What is a candy card? Plus two attack. I could turn the raccoon into a absolute beast. Vampire, really, as well. Let's get the raccoon buffed. And... Level up this doggo. And I summon, give it five attacks. So we just need something that summons, I guess. Give five health to ally behind. Okay, we've got some potentially good hands coming up. The enemy this turn has 40 health. All right. Not a good turn to have the vampire. Hmm. I wonder if it's worth, can I save it? Will it come back through my deck? I'm not quite sure. Anyway, um, I think you've attack to you, then you shoot him, he'll do that. Do I risk it? May as well. Okay. Alright. Raccoon, you go last. You help buff the raccoon. Go there. Sounds good. Yep, easy. That raccoon has turned into an absolute beast. 14-8. That's a big overkill. Shame to get rewarded for overkill. Cucumber. Activate again for health. Nice, actually. The weightlifter, I'll get the cucumber. I'm gonna buff the crap out of this raccoon. I don't think I'll buff the dog anymore. Heart eyes. He's good. I'll grab that. Another weightlifter. You see, uh, where are we? That's level two. Hamster. Candy. Done. Now, let's merge these fellas. Activated, gain five attack, that's good. I've got one coin left, need to spend it, so let's re-roll. Flamingo, 
when hurt, give the ally a head, a buff. How will that work, I wonder? Ally buffed, shoot the enemy for 4 damage, that's good. Or shoot the enemy for 4 damage. I'm going to, how do I freeze? Right click. Cool. Alright, this guy has 50 health this time. Okay, you're going to give health to this guy. He's going to buff himself for 5 attack as well. Hmm. You'll do that, you'll do that, you'll do that. Let's go. Might kill him in one go here. Yes. Certainly have. Such a simple concept, but man, this is satisfying. Wonderful. Package. When destroyed, summon a 3-3 copy of the strongest card from your entire deck as a level 1. Alright, well, summon. Goes with the dog. Gonna get the mind blown. Gonna get another dog. Uh, destroyed. Summon a mouse. There's another summon. When activated, give all other allies 2-2. We have Joy, have a level 1 Joy. Joy, Mouse, Party Popper. And Party Popper the package. Precisely. Devil. Hand play, deal 1 damage to all enemies. Excuse me. Let's see what happens there. So, we've got the dog. Got the package. When he dies, he summons the dog buffs that summon. Vampire. When activated, set health equal to 100% of the healthiest ally's health. Potentially the dog, so that's a good buff. Actually. That'll buff the dog, which will then make the vampire stronger. Uh, we'll shoot the enemy, give to attack, shoot the enemy. Yeah, you're on destroy, you're on hurt. That'll do. Let's play. Oh. Okay, interesting. Doesn't matter, we won, but... Okay, so basically anything with one health just died instantly then. <laughs> Luckily it didn't completely screw me over. Starting on round 6, you can buy relics. It takes 4 re-rolls to re-roll the relic shop once. Relics cost 2 coins each. Relics trigger in order from left to right. Remove currently owned relics by right-clicking. Increase max hand size by 2. I'm not re-rolling that. That's awesome. Ally summoned, give it 2-2, two, two. it's another summon buff. Uh, card 3 attack and negative 1 health. Um, why not? Kissing one on sale, that's nice. Increase health by 50% of base health. Another hard eyes would be good. So, why are you shiny? I don't really want to merge you because I don't want to risk losing that if it's good. Hmm. Um. I think I might just leave it as it is for now. See what happens. Two attack, 140 health. Fingers are ramping up. We've got a summon. We've got a summon. We've got a fairy. Hmm. Do 
you get a nice buff at the end there. I suppose that's all we can really do at this stage. Okay. Some good damage there. Okay. Still don't know what this uh, shiny card is. Got the two dogs, but of course no summons now. Start with you. Uh, I guess you'll buff the dog. Activate it, give attack, give attack. Give three, three, and you can summon, uh, you can buff this dog, I suppose. Let's go. Battle one. All rise. Thumbtack. When activated, deal one damage to self twice. Okay. Interesting. Uh, I do have reason to get another dog. I suppose I can look on upgrading those. I'm going to reroll again. A horse rider. When destroyed, summon a 10 10 horse. Bill, give 50% of attack to Ella behind. I'm gonna do these two. I'll upgrade the fairy. I'll upgrade the dog. Don't think I've got a level three yet. Um, okay, so we've got a few little synergies going. A bit of a few summons. A few summon buffs. Um Next time we should get another relic, hopefully. We survive. Okay. None of my summon buffs are here. Which is concerning. You give five health to this, then when the vampire activates, you take that health. Uh, plus two attack, two attack. Hmm. Doesn't fill me with confidence, but we'll do that, I suppose. Job there, raccoon. Okay, here we go, summon a 10-10 horse, which will become 14-14, which will become 19-14, raccoon goes there, and can't go past another little summon there, but this will get extra buffs, yeah, let's go, that is a big horse. And we've won. Nice. Okay, a little bit of overkill. That's fine. <laughs> Beautiful. The juggler. The crusty juggler. Give all allies 1-1. One, one. Oh, what's this? There are three or more duplicate allies. Increase their stats by 100. Interesting. the enemy for four a pair two one to attack what do I need I need a I can buy that and upgrade I can also buy the mind blower and upgrade so let's combine these so you give ally a plus five and mind blown when hurt shoot the enemy for eight that's potentially really good. If I can buff some health, uh, like put him behind a hard eyes. Very good. Uh, 
Who am I gonna buff? Maybe you. The longer you survive, the more damage you do, obviously. Summon a Tutu Cloud. Upgrade the mouse, not yet. I'll save that one. 2 and 280, this Enrage. Let's go. Alright. Horse Rider. Be there. When you activate, we get five health. It's better than nothing. All right, let's do that. I like that horse. Doing good work for me. Last cannon that raccoon need to buff his health. Okay, you summon a cloud. You buff that cloud. Give all other allies 2 2. Five health. Sure, why not? Let's go. Oh, that's when hurt summon a cloud. <laughs> right, that's even better than I thought. That is cool. Okay, happy with that. For some reason I just assumed it was uh, on death. So who knew that there was still life in an auto battler genre that uses emojis? If you just expand your view outside of just using animals, it's amazing what you can do. Summon a copy of this unit with one help. That's interesting. I like that. I'm gonna get the rat, I'm gonna get the horse. I'm gonna get all this, really. Uh, I'm gonna roll once. Look who it is. Super Auto Pets come to life. Ally destroyed. Shoot the enemy for 100% of that ally's attack. Shoot the enemy for 50. Attack when hurt. Destroyed. Summon two fish. Oh, choices. When ally is destroyed, shoot the enemy for 100% of that ally's attack. So you can sit at the back and when things drop down, you're just far and away. I like that, yeah. Then upgrade the rat, the mouse. Oh, it is a rat, yep. Destroy destroyed summons two mice, nice. What else do we have? You're not ready to upgrade yet. Yeah, there's the horse, we'll keep that separate for now. See how we go. 350 health. Gonna be scary. We've got a summon, we've got a summon. We've got a summon buffer. We've got a raccoon that's gonna go nuts. And you go there, you will Get a bit of a buff. That'll do. Oh, a zombie. Nice. Getting to a decent little uh, summon build here. And that raccoon does some damage. All right. Here we go. You sit at the back. You summon. You buff. You summon. You summon. Calling it now. I think we win this turn. <laughs> Comfortably. Quite like that. Beautiful. What else have we got here? Golden Raccoon. Milk. Swap the health and attack of a card. 
After attack, gain four attack. Wow. So that's a familiar little piggy. Destroy gives 50% of attack to ally behind. Okay. Give 100% of the weakest allies attack to all other allies. Holy moly. I mean, yeah. Raccoon. Yes, please. Okay, we keep the gold. That's good to know. Whatever it means. Ally destroy gain 8 attack. Lovely. Uh, these are both on sale. After attack, gain 4 attack. Who would benefit from that? Someone with lots of health. Cloud, maybe? That is now a chilly cloud. Pop the attack and health of a card. Not sure we really benefit from that at the moment. Let's say we roll. Another raccoon, call it nerds. LA ahead destroyed, move back one space. <laughs> Interesting. All right, um, freeze that. I think I'll just plan for another raccoon upgrade, to be honest. Does this buff the stats? It does, okay, so that's not for nothing. And played deal two damage to all enemies, that's concerning. Some of my cards still only have two health. Alright, you're a summon. You're a summon. You get hit by that scissor, you are going to shoot the enemy. You're gonna buff. Oh, hang on. I can pull that back, that's good. Another summon, another summon a buff. There we go. Now, what was this again? Give 100% of the weakest allies attack to all other allies. So the weakest is two. So I'll just give everyone a two attack buff. Nice. That's a lot of damage. Alright. Okay, we've got a few things going on here. Get these summoners out the front. And these guys that benefit from it. At the back. But you'll die instantly, that's fine though. You'll summon. The rest should survive. Let's go. Love that gorilla. Doing great work. Slide overkill. Okay, here we are again. Sick destroyed. No. Oh, do I have a sick? Yeah, I could upgrade that, I suppose. We'll get the vampire. I'm gonna roll. When hand is played, summon a copy of your strongest unit from your entire deck as a 4-4. Okay. <laughs> I'm listening. Uh, mind blown. Very level 2. A fairy. Very level 2. Um, what the hell? I'll just grab those. And just stack them, I guess, just to get a bit of a buff happening. Uh, definitely a vampire towards a level up. At a level two, sick. What else is it going to do? That, I think. Just tidy up the deck a little bit. Three and 480. All right, ramping up now. So what was this again? We've got bigger max hand size. We've got 
When a hand is played, 100% of the weakest allies attack goes to all other allies, and when a hand is played, we summon the strong copy of the strongest unit from your entire deck as a 4-4. Alright. A few summons happening here, so we're going to put the fairy at the back. I'm going to put the package, the package, the wind face, and the zombie. Is that a good call? Yeah, why not? <laughs> a bit crazy. Not a bad turn. I can see that cloud synergizing with the gorilla at some stage. Every time he gets an attack off, against four attack. Then when he finally dies, he'll have a huge attack stat and that gorilla will just launch it. All right. Chuck a horse, you get the gorilla, a couple of dogs. Shoot the enemy for 200 attack. Why not? So there's that jar summoning that zombie to start off with as well. That's quite nice. And once again, a nice comfortable win. Definitely want the package. Level that straight up. Summon a 6-6 six, six copy of the strongest card from your deck as level 2. I'm laughing, what am I up to? That's level 2, that's fine. Um, let's roll. Give a card plus 1 experience. This unit is prioritized for random effects, nice. Uh, I want the horse. Let's look at those level 2. 2020 horse now, that's nice. Uh, another zombie, got another raccoon. Yep, yep. And let's just, let's treat this raccoon. Let's try and get him buff. Uh, I'm going to leave that zombie separate though. I think. One more roll. Definitely want that. I think we do want the weightlifter. Maybe. Very, yeah. Um, it's on sale. Why not? Let's move. Okay. No gorilla, unfortunately. Nothing. Hmm. Not the best summon hand, but start. Hello. Jeez, that's a lot of health. Okay, there's a gorilla. It's not too late for him. I do you like the raccoon though? It's gonna buff really nicely. I'm gonna get that horse out, I'm gonna get the zombie out. So, oh no, I think we can manage. Yeah, very gorilla. Now I just regain eight attack. Maybe I wanna do this. Because that's going to have a huge attack. So if the enemy reaches that and it dies, the grill is going to smack him. Let's try that. There's our 2020 horse summon. Check this out. 
Bam. <laughs> so after all that, still did a decent amount of overkill. Third hand played. Increase all allies attack by 100%. Oh, um, hmm. It's tempting. Got to be better than this, but I've got to lend three hands to benefit from it. Oh, yeah, I think, I think, I think it's better. All right, um, vampire, fairy, you. Do that, do that. Where's our vampire? He's level 2 now. When activated, set health equal to 150% of the healthiest ally's health. We're rolling. New stuff. 3 attack, sorry, 3 health minus 1 attack. Give a card 2 1. Ally ahead attacks gain 1 1. When hurt, shoot the enemy. When the ally ahead is buffed, give 50% of that buff to the ally behind. That could be ridiculous. Gain 100% of health as attack. Oh. So, I'll put that say behind. Ah, oh, see, most of my buffs are at the back of the pack. So this will force them forward. Hmm. I'm going to give the carrot to the raccoon. I'm going to give the pear to the cloud. That's what I'm going to do. I might freeze you. 960 health. Alright, Gorilla, you're up, buddy. Your first, your second. Ah, uh, we, zomb we zombie up, we zombie up. Do it. Unfortunately, the summons aren't getting the buffs. We don't have a dog or a fairy. But these high damage zombies are at least making the gorilla pay off a bit. That was quite good as well. I mean, not a bad turn, still a hugely tanky enemy. Alright, raccoon goes back. Horse is at front. Uh, when the vampire is activated, maybe. Do that so when that dies, it'll heal this. No, this has to activate first, that won't work. This has to go there, that still won't be the healthiest. You can go away. Um, what is going on up here in this confused head of mine? Let's maybe. Buff the horse summon. Might be the way to go. And the zombies, of course, yeah. That's a tanky horse. There we go. That worked out okay. Jeez, that's ridiculous damage from the raccoon. Love to see it. Another dog? What's a dog situation? 
Two level two dogs. Maybe it's time. Maybe it's time. I'll grab that. What's the skunk do? When activated, deal one damage to all allies with hurt abilities two times. Could be good. Maybe not for this build. When destroyed, give 50% of attack to the ally behind. Hmm, that could be good on a zombie or something. But... Let's roll. Teddy bear. Ally destroyed, give one health to random ally. Give all current and future cards in the shop 1-1. One, one. Where's our horse he at? He's level 2. Raccoon must be getting close to level 3. Freeze that. Roll. And played. Give the rightmost ally 3 attack permanently. Get out of here. God, some of these are sounding so good. They're just not fitting in with my current build. Package. Off the package for a dollar. Um, hmm. I think I'm just going to buy the horse. The horse is no slouch, even at level 1. 1200 health. Alright. You're up, horsey. I don't like this draw at all. we do that. Jeez, this is not going to go well. Not, not a very convincing opening hand. That's okay. Raccoon, definitely want the zombie, definitely want the cloud, definitely want the fairy. Five attack to ally behind, five health to ally behind. I believe I want that, because then the raccoon at least will get another two hits in. And by then should be hopefully white buff. It with all these summons. Raccoon's getting nice and tanky back there. Okay, that's not a bad turn. Alright, we do get all our cards back. That's the first time I've uh, <laughs> run out of cards and got to the third hand, so that's an interesting sign. Um, we do want Gorilla. Summons, we want summons. Give five attack, that means the gorilla's gonna go off. However, however, that's not bad either. I'd love to have both. But, you know, maybe the increased survivability will count for something with the fairy. Yeah, I think it will, because it'll obviously get another hit in, won't it? So, yep, yeah, let's let's do that. Everyone's attack just got launched, thanks to the uh, bronze medal. There we go. Speed things up. Okay, so in the end, we still did overkill. <laughs> just took three hands to do it. All right, Clown. Copy the ability of the ally ahead as if it were level 1. Yep. 
Ogre. Hurt gain three attack. Interesting. Hmm. Hand played increase health by 20%. Oh boy. Oh boy. What's our fairy at level two and a half? I suppose I'll buy a fairy. Raccoon and horse, definitely, because now. Raccoon's level three. Gotta be huge. Um. Off that. Merge those. What's our um, rat doing? He's level two, he's fine. Activated, give all other allies five health. Another raccoon. Birthday cake, exit shop, give all allies one attack permanently. <laughs> okay. What's our dog doing? That'll get it to level three dog. Party Popper could be could be good too. Um, let's go the dog. And now you give any allied summoned a attack. Beautiful. Let's roll. Um, doesn't excite me too much. This scares the hell out of me though. Let's see how we go. Oh, not a good, not a good start. Really not a good start. The enemy for eight, she did me for four. Oh, so that's the gold one. Still, they're both level one, but that's doing twice as much. It's not as much as level two. Interesting. Sadly, I think they're the best chance we have of doing some damage, which is pathetic. Did he heal above his starting health just because I did other old damage to him? <laughs> Alright, it's Raccoon's time to shine. With Gorilla. With Cloud. A buffed Cloud? damage but I'm still feeling way off. Ah but we get our raccoon back. Nice. Get that horse out there. May not be too bad. May not be too bad. And that activates it'll get 14 health which is fine. Fingers crossed. Nice. God, I love that raccoon. <laughs> what have we got? Hamster. Mechanic. Hand play. Trigger all act ally activated abilities as if they were level one. Ally destroyed. Summon a 3-3 ghost in its place. Holy moly. Let's get it. Fifty percent of stats to random ally. Mind blown. I think I had a few of those, didn't I? Yeah, I'm just gonna combine all these. Yeah, that's that gold is a big buff. So hang on, five to ally behind. 
10. Gotcha, okay. That makes sense now. And play. Give four health to all allies, then deal one damage to them four times. <laughs> okay. That will have merit in some builds for sure. Skull. Summon a copy of this unit and then destroy it. Okay. Uh, what did I just buy? Oh, a zombie. Summon a copy of this unit with one health works two times per turn. That's a good upgrade. How's my vamp looking? He's level two. Uh, package, level two. Mm. Three health, minus one attack. Is that something else for the raccoon? So I'm going to copy of this unit, then destroy it. So what do I have that's good on destruction? Pack, uh, like a horse? Because that'll just instantly give me a 2020 horse. Yeah. Yes, please. Four damage now. Less health, but four damage. That's big. Perfect little setup here. Raccoon, Tombstone, Skull Horse, Regular Horse. No, no, no Regular Horse. Wind Face, Level 2 Zombie. We be summoning. Jesus. The raccoon's already at uh, 100, 100 damage. Oh, that's amazing. 200 damage. Jesus. It was a thousand overkill as well on the first turn. Unreal. Santa. Ally summoned give all allies for attack. Cards in the shop are three times more likely to appear discounted. I think I do want the gorilla. Watermelon's pretty good as well. 4 1. benefit from that the most zombie yeah four gold left activate increase attack by 33% Zombie again. Zombie again. Get him nice and buff. There we go. All right, what have we got here? Fifteen hundred. Get one of these. That'll be nice. Um, I think that has to be in there as well. Yeah, let's go. Not a bad turn. Well, this could be a good one as well.
Yeah. Actually. There. <laughs> this gets ridiculous. What is going on? <laughs> Didn't make it past the first monster. Or emoji, I should say. Yeah, that's pretty convincing. What level are you? They're pretty close, actually. Shark. Ally summon, destroy it and gain 50% of its stats. Well, okay. That's getting a bit crazy for my taste. Oh, there's a Santa there. What's my experience? What can I level up? What's on the cusp? Another level two. Oh, the gorilla. I think I have to. One fifty percent of the allies attack. That's just ridiculous now. Um, what's that vampy doing? Level two. I think this has to be it. Pretty good. Uh, out of money, four two thousand. All right. Not the most convincing build here. When you activate, you'll be nine. I suppose that's not too bad. Yeah, three hits off. Oh no, one fifty percent now, isn't it? So that'll be even better. Yeah, I think that makes sense. Um, didn't want doing that actually. Didn't put it there to be honest. Do that. I'm going to slow this down because I can't even tell what these ghosts are doing. They're doing alright. Jesus. So just basically guaranteed 17 damage three times for everything that dies. Not a bad turn. Want to turn to have all these and nothing that'll benefit from it. Um, that's ridiculous. That's got to go there. Actually, you go there. No, well, all summons, nothing to buff them. <laughs> Let's speed this up again. There's a lot happening. Alright, need a serious turn this time. Yes. Yes. Definitely. Sounds good to me. Strongest unit. So is that still the, the zombie? 15 has to be. Let's slow this down again. That's crazy. This is at 38 already.
Well, it's one way to do it. <laughs> Major overkill too. Um, how long does this game go for? Actually, don't know. There might not be a limit. Uh, light bulb. Yeah, that could be good. Definitely want that. Activate the ability as if it were level one. Doesn't work. Nope. Um, no, maybe not. What was this again? Oh, yeah. Um, a horse? Yeah, another level two horse would be good. Zombie? Ah, oh, there's another Santa. Damn it. That's right. Um, buff the zombie. Get that horse up. Raccoon's maxed, isn't it? Yeah. Fairy 2? Yeah. Um, we'll go with that. So 4, 2,500. Okay. Summon build. There you get the buffs. Get you out there. Get you out there. 10 health to ally behind. Could be good. Oh, the best we're going to get. Let's go. Okay, not too bad. This needs to be the big turn, though. And it just might be with this combination. Ridiculous. I don't recall the last time I played a game for the first time that seemed so complex and yet felt so overpowered. <laughs> Pretty good. I like a head buff to gain a buff for 50% of that amount. If that goes on the gorilla, he's usually behind. The raccoon. Could be good. Um, oh, I may as well give it a go. Oh, one experience as well. Who's close? Ah, oh, wind face. There we go. Um... Oh, that's dangerous. What else can we do? Gorilla. Stock the shop with one discounted donut. <laughs> Summon a copy and destroy. Okay, that could work on the horse. On the other horse. And then Gorilla may as well. Oh, that'll have to do. Okay, you're up there, you're there. It's pretty good. Should hopefully do Enough damage to offset that 20% though. Maybe. <laughs> Alright, we've just offset it.
Okay. Um, alright. Definitely want you. Six, six. Um, it's not great. Not great, not great. So that gives everyone a four attack at least. So that's going to go. It's going to come in handy. Not convinced it's going to be a winning combination. Then again, <laughs> it's going to be crazy. So well and truly ahead on damage here. It should be okay. This would be a good combo, actually. Overkill again, actually. I was getting a bit nervous. Alright, grab him. Ooh, what have we got here? Shoot the enemy for 50% 50, 50 of the allies' attack. This is not terrible. That could be good behind a raccoon. that. Yeah, I'll grab that. Alright, so we want... Do I want two of those? Maybe I do. So five now and 2800. Scary. Freeze that, freeze that, absolutely. Let's go. Okay, put you there, get you out, get you out. Bit lackluster. That's not gonna work. No, it's not going to work at all. That's all right. I'll have to do that. Let's go. Really missing that summon buff. They're just not doing the damage we need. That's pretty poor, actually. Um, but this turn should be better. This is a dilemma. Lots of summons going on. Do I want to buff him or do I want to be shooting? I think this is just a all around better thing to have. Love to have both, but. That's the way to go. Jesus. <laughs> the zombies get up to like 80 damage. Alright, pretty close now. You, 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 and some buffs. That should do it. Uh, 
And there it is. Speed right through that. Just curious to see what the overkill is. Over a thousand, nice. Okay, buy that, buy that. Get them buffed immediately. Save that for now. Let's do this. Yeah, that's not bad. Those together, that's fine. Five and forty two hundred. Okay, definitely want that and that and that. Looks good. <laughs> Jeez, it just doesn't end, does it? it doesn't end. Crazy. Good turn. Yes, please. Yes, please. Yes, please. There we go. Um. Ten health or six six. One two. I think this all. That no, doesn't really matter in the end. It's just ridiculous that buff. Alright. Last chance. You're up there. You're there. Want you, want you, and want you. Do it. Should surely be safe, shouldn't we? No. Fell just short. That's disappointing. 22 rounds, 33,000 damage. 700 average damage per hand. Highest damage is 2294. Oh, yeah. When you combine these two, plus this. A good time. <laughs> MVP was the dog. How does that work? He's played 24 times, was he? Golden Relic scene. Don't remember seeing a Golden Relic. Must have missed that. Number of times face was played. Why is he the MVP when the horse was played more? Anyway. Number of shop appearances, interesting. Okay. Very good. Well, I'll wrap it up there. If you're interested in this game, and it is very fun just from what you've seen, <laughs> um, I'll leave a link to it in the description. So I recommend you check it out. You can wishlist it. Check out the demo right now. And uh, if you like this and want to see more like it, consider subscribing. It helps me out a lot and keeps you in the loop. So thanks again, and I will see you next time.